Hello everyone. Today there's been a new version of AI DPS meter that came out, so it's actually compatible with the uh, 5.1 update. So I thought I'd just show you a little script that allows you to launch AI DPS meter before Aeon, so you don't forget about it. And also allows you to launch Aeon in 32-bit version, which you will have noticed since the last update helps a lot to reduce the random freezes and lags and stuff. Uh, I'll leave you the script. What it does is go to the AI DPS meter folder, um, execute AI DPS meter, and then do the same with Aeon with some arguments to ensure that you're connecting to the right server. Uh, all you have to do is edit this location to point to the main directory of AI DPS meter, and edit this location here to point to the Aeon main download folder, uh, the one containing bin 32, bin 64 objects, effects, data, and all that stuff. Um, so you just save this as a .bat file and then you can just create a shortcut and put it on the desktop if you want. Uh, here it is. Uh, so I'm gonna just edit this, uh, change the name so it doesn't contain shortcut, that's ugly in my opinion. Uh, and I can also change the icon to make it point to the actual Aeon icon which is located just next to the download folder, the main Aeon one. Uh, so you do that and then all you have to do is double click it and it will launch both AI DPS meter and Aeon. And here we are in Aeon and as you will notice AI DPS meter works just fine. I can even do some great damage on that dummy and you will see that my damage appears correctly. Uh, note that you will still need to launch the launcher when there's an update because this skips the launcher part obviously and you will experience some problems if you forget to do an update and connect to the client anyway. Have fun and till next time!